right, now that you have the bass line under your belt, let's tackle the upper register notes, the melody, which uh, all take place on the top four strings. Uh, most of the picking revolves around the outside the string picking approach, sort of an economy picking form. Uh, we'll also fret each note with the index, middle, ring, and pinky fingers, each assigned to the first, second, third, and fourth frets, respectively, except for one note where we actually will use our pinky on the third fret of the second string. I'll count you in uh, with a four count, even though it's in seven. So uh, here we go. Three and four and a one and a two and three and four and five and six and seven and one and a two and three and four and five and six and seven and a one and a two and three and four and five and six and seven and one and a two and three and four and five and six e and seven and up. Okay, I know that seems like a kind of a pain, uh, but towards the end in the second measure, it's the D on the third fret of the second string where you're going to actually end up needing to use your pinky. Hopefully I got it in there. And uh, also, hopefully my tuning holds up. I noticed my second string's already freaking out. Uh, at regular speed, it'll end up being like this. Kind of weird without the bass line, but I think you get the idea. Uh, make sure you come back for part three and we'll put the beast together. All right.